As with all medicine, early diagnosis and treatment can help people with their overall health. Just as with a physical, it makes sense to visit an ophthalmologist for a routine eye exam. During a routine eye exam, a series of tests are performed to assess visual acuity, refraction, and potential eye disease. Your ophthalmologist will begin by asking a series of questions about your medical and eye health history, including any noticeable eye problems. Next, your ophthalmologist will evaluate your visual acuity by determining the smallest letters you can read on a standardized eye chart from 14 to 20 feet away. Your ophthalmologist will also test for refractive errors. There are four types of refractive error. Myopia, or nearsightedness, where close objects will look clearer, but distant objects will appear blurred. Hyperopia, or farsightedness, where distant objects will look clear, but close objects will appear blurred. Astigmatism, where both distance and close vision may appear blurry. And presbyopia, where the eyes gradually lose the ability to see things up close. Typically, this will make reading difficult. Many people will have one or more of these errors. To correct a refractive error, an ophthalmologist may recommend glasses, contacts, or refractive surgery. In additional tests, an ophthalmologist will examine eyelid health and function, coordination of eye muscles, pupil response to light, side or peripheral vision, intraocular pressure, the pressure inside the eye, anterior segment of the eye, the area in front of the lens, including the cornea and iris, and the interior and back of the eye, including the retina. After the examination, your ophthalmologist will discuss the results with you. If there is any eye disease, treatments with medication, including eye drops, may be recommended. In some cases, certain eye diseases require laser surgery or other surgical procedures. Some of the treatments are taken care of by your ophthalmologist, or you may be referred to a subspecialist, such as a retina or cornea specialist. When there are no particular problems, there are recommended intervals for eye examinations. The American Academy of Ophthalmology recommends that infants should have an eye exam within the first three months from birth. After that, the next exam should be between ages six months and one year and then again between ages three to three and a half years. For children, eye exams can be given by ophthalmologists, pediatricians, family physicians, nurse practitioners, or physician assistants. For adults, a visit to the ophthalmologist is recommended at the following intervals. At least once between the ages of 20 and 29. At least twice between the ages of 30 and 39. Every two to four years between the ages of 40 and 64. And for those over 65, every one to two years. For those aged 20 to 29 with risk factors for glaucoma, which includes people of African descent or those who have a family history of glaucoma, an eye exam is recommended every three to five years. And for those 30 to 39 at risk for glaucoma, an eye exam is recommended every two to four years. Regular visits to an ophthalmologist are good preventive medicine and will help preserve and maximize vision throughout a lifetime.